The following is a detailed description of the restoration project by Mr. Jeff Poole and Mr. Kevin Christopher. The Marconi radio belongs to the Wilsick family for over 60 years. The restoration project was completed during August, 2011 for Innovative. Many thanks to Kevin and Jeff for their passion for antique radios. Here is the work completed by Jeff, with consultant Kevin by his side. Work on restoring the Marconi 294 started this afternoon as my partner Jeff Poole insisted we make this radio a priority. On preliminary inspection we see a problem with the dial scale. It is shrunken, and some of the paint has peeled. Efforts have been made to overcome the problem, but there really is not much that can be done to salvage a dial like this. We will treat it as a fragile part, and try not to aggravate the problem. There are some paint splashes on the cabinet and knobs, and enough of the finish is deteriorated to warrant a complete stripping and refinishing. Looking at the insides, we notice some dust accumulation as is expected in a 60-year-old radio. Kevin also noticed the chassis mounting screws are missing. In one of the photos, Jeff is removing the chassis. We see the dust on the plates of the tuning capacitor. We looked underneath, and see a very clean chassis, with no evidence of having been worked on. Jeff removes the speaker and then proceeds to clean and test the tubes. We find three weak tubes. Next Jeff cleans the chassis with a vacuum hose and brush. We then decide to apply power to the radio. The radio is working reasonably well. We then remove the grill and speaker board and Jeff polished the brass trims. The grill cloth is in very good condition and there is minor discoloration of the brass trim. We start checking out the usual culprits in the chassis, that are known to give trouble. Jeff measures a 220k ohm resistor and finds it has changed value to 519k. This is a common problem with the plate resistor of the driver tube. While work is proceeding on the chassis Jeff starts scraping and sanding the cabinet. Jeff then repaints the edge trim with the first coat of walnut brown, while Kevin worked away at the components. Finally, Jeff solders in a capacitor and we call it a night. After the second coat of trim paint set we resanded the cabinet and applied a varnish stain which mimics the original finish. This will set overnight and then we will apply a couple coats of polyurethane. The grill cloth was cleaned and the speaker remounted. The knobs were cleaned and the brass inserts polished. Jeff then applied a piece of brass trim after installing the speaker board. After installing the dial and chassis the knobs are put in place as one for the finishing touches. Next we power it up and run a test on it to be sure it is preforming as it should. Jeff is proud of his participation in this project. Thanks again to Jeff and Kevin for all their efforts to bring life back to the Smartoni radio.